All right, guys, coming to you from the Active House booth, I would be remiss if we didn't spend a few minutes with this smart Italian guy right here. <laughs> Francesco is one of the original founders of Masana Radiant Cooling from Italy. Yeah. And I gotta tell you, this is a, a bit of a mind bender right here, but you can actually cool your house with chilled water. Francesco, will you give us a little tour of your booth and, yeah. and how you could cool your house with, with water? Absolutely, so we probably can start from the engine and the about yeah, so you know the, so the space about, pack out here is actually yeah. making the chilled water right exactly so, so heat pump is a made hot water and chill water yeah both either one it's got a setting to hot or cold perfect you have two lines so plan return going a small buffer tank from the buffer tank is going to a manifold okay so inside the manifold is chilled water what kind of temperature are we talking about for chilled water is that uh, 50 degrees 30 degrees could be between 46 to 55 degrees. So almost the same coil temperature as a as a uh, you know a standard AC system, right? Exactly. Okay. But we like to modulate the water, so it's not always a fixed water temperature. It could be varied based on what, based on dew point inside of the house. Got it. Because when we talk about radiant cooling, we need to evaluate the dew point. Got it. And to evaluate the dew point, you need to know two different measurements: temperature and humidity. Okay. All right, so so let me let me back you up just for one sec. Yep. So like at my house, if I've got a glass of cold water that the ice in it, you know how the water condenses on the outside of the glass and you get a puddle of water? That glass is cold when I touch it and it feels cold, but we want to avoid the condensation, that dew point, and that's where you, that's where you guys have a lot of smart tech that's involved here. Exactly. So we display today the sensor. This is called M Sense, Misana sensor, and through the sensor we can measure temperature of the air, mm -hmm. the humidity, and evaluate the dew point. Okay. In the last few years, we also add a VOC sensor. Wow, a VOC yeah. sensor, yeah. All Air right. quality became very important for homeowner now. Yeah. So, and through the VOC sensor, now we can also activate an HRV on ERV as well. All right, so if you had a Panasonic or a, uh, you know, a Zender ERV, you could send a signal over that says, hey, my quality is not great in here. Let's kick that thing into high or kick it on because now we're starting to have an elevated level. Exactly. We didn't need it on before. And this is no, this uh, today we display different um, solution of hydronic system. Messana manufacture a radiant city. This is really cool. Yes. These are panels right here that you can see are, are meant to, to snap in your pet, probably PEX tubing, right? Yep. The PEX tubing would have that chilled water in it. And then this metal panel would have drywall installed over top. You can kind of see it on the display. So that now when I'm in Texas in my house and it's hot outside or the sun's coming in and heating up this space, this is actually sucking the heat Excellent. off of me and taking that heat outside where that heat pump is exchanging it and making it cold again. It's a little bit of the opposite of air conditioner dust. You, you don't receive, you don't, there's no blowing cold yeah. air. No, you, no, no you, fan whatsoever. No, you release your heat. So classic example of radiant cooling when you go in a church or in mm -hmm. a cave. Oh, that's a great example, so yeah. So you release your heat. Why? Because the heat moves to the cold. Right, so that's you're physics. in that cold underground exactly. wine storage, let's exactly. say. We cannot build homes anymore with stones like we did in the past, but we can activate ceiling. Oh, that's so a that's I love active that house, active ceiling. And we are human, so we are active people. That's, that's a really great example. That yeah. makes a lot of sense to me. You're underground, you feel yeah. good, it feels cold. This, that's the same thing. This is doing the same yes. thing. And I've had a house with radiant heat before. There's no noise, there's yeah. no fan. It feels great in there. But I gotta ask you though, we, we have to have something else that's dealing with humidity, right? Because that's oh, only yeah. dealing with sensible yes. heat, not latent heat. So exactly. then what do we do? We have a separate dehumidifier probably, right? We can have, we also manufacture ATU, meaning air treatment unit. Okay. It's a combi unit can do multiple things. Ventilation, dehumidification, and integration as well. But differently than the other dehumidification unit, we don't introduce the heat inside of the house. Because to me, it doesn't make sense during summertime in Texas, for example, okay. you remove the moisture and you introduce the heat in the house. Sure. So now you use more sure. AC to, sure. doesn't make sense. Anyway, so we offer that. And solution. What is this guy down here? This small guy here is a is a trench clima canal hydronic fan coil. It's a, it's manufactured by um, Belgium companies named Jaga, Jaga, and uh, it's basically it's a 
with this unit, we can integrate with the rest of the system because this unit has also an hydronic coil. Okay, so in other words, this is gonna get a tap from your manifold. Exactly, half inch. We're gonna put chilled water into here. Yep. And this coil is gonna get cold just like a standard AC coil. Exactly, but it's ductless. As you can see, you mount this on the floor, on the ceiling, yep. or on the wall, and you don't need any ducts, basically. And you've got a little grate to go over top. And then this little uh, kind of squirrel cage fan it's, down it's here. It's a low fan, yep. It's just a low voltage fan. 24 volt. Will Probably. be definitely power into our M box here. Uh -huh. And everything will be integrated through floor, ceiling, HRV, and YAG as well. Oh it's a complete gosh. solution for. Uh, for your uh, HVAC system in the house. I have got to do something with you guys someday. Yeah. This is the it's coolest a lot. system. Probably 10 minutes, not enough. But <laughs> we we could probably started. go two hours on this topic, yeah, but sure. how can people find out more about your systems or, or find more about you guys? Yeah, Mestana Radiant Cooling. Uh, you know, it's online for sure. We are based in California. Okay. Uh, we work with typically with architect, mechanical engineer. Yep. And uh, yeah, you can contact us and yeah. If you've got one of these systems in your house under construction or you're talking to these guys, you need to call me because I need to do some videos on Absolutely. this. Absolutely. Francisco, thank, thank you so much. Thank Appreciate you so much. it. Nice to meet you. IBS 2023.